Oh shit. Audio log for Phil Wilson, medical technician, Delta Labs, October 20th, 2145. Today I witnessed the third test of the teleporter in the three weeks that I've been here. Volunteers are becoming harder and harder to come by, and it isn't difficult to see why. They all come back screaming like loons about demons, pools of blood, it's real fire and brimstone stuff. At first I wasn't paying much attention, just doing my job, but... The last was Robert Clayton. Now, I met him my first day here. This guy chews up rocks and spits out gravel as tough as they come. Having to sedate him and drag his drooling body to the isolation, it's really freaked me out. I'm gonna put in for a transfer as soon as I'm able. As requested, the following is my initial feedback on my first trip through the portal. Private First Class Frank Cinder stated October 15th, 2145. I, uh, I don't know exactly where to begin. Obviously, I survived the first trip and feel no worse for the wear. I, I'm not feeling any of the symptoms reported by the others who have gone in before me, but I'm at a point where I'm still trying to process everything. Thankfully, the place looks deserted and devoid of any life, but, uh, the flames and heat and the stench of the place, it, it smells of death, decay, and burnt flesh. Tomorrow we're going back in with some of the eggheads, um, science division, to start securing forward positions and we expect to start sending out the mapping droids at the same time. Well, I must admit on a personal note that I, I, I've got a really, really bad feeling about this. I don't
don't understand what we're doing there or, or, or what we hope to prove. PFC Cinders, signing off. Oh, y'all. Shit. Fuck! How many is this in there for me? Soda. <laughs> 